Hi, I'm Amy Lewis with Solid Fire, and I'm here with Christopher. Christopher, can you introduce yourself? Hi, my name is Christopher Edo. I am a product architect at Mirantis. So what's the most exciting thing you've seen, heard, or done here at OpenStack Summit? The most exciting thing I've uh, seen and been involved in here uh, at the summit is the OpenStack application catalog at apps.openstack.org. So I uh, helped the OpenStack Foundation launch this catalog, which is a community-driven repository of uh, Glance images, heat templates, and Murano application packages, giving uh, users of OpenStack one place to go to find the things to use with their OpenStack or with their environment. So what are some of the cases you've heard? What are, what's the feedback you're hearing about this? People are super excited. Uh, during the, they launched it today during the keynote, um, and it was, it's been killing me for the last couple of weeks I've been working on it, but we're not, we weren't allowed to talk about it on the dev list, and I really wanted to, to talk to people about it and say, hey, look, I know you are building images with Disk Image Builder. I know you're, you got these awesome heat templates. Here's a place to put them. So uh, what was really cool yeah. is I was on my laptop, during the keynote, uh, just taking some notes, and then I, about five minutes after they announced it, someone from Suze uh, had gone there, and they were uploading their own uh, image into the Glance section. So it was like instant, instant hit. Okay, seaplane tours, good idea or active insanity? Super good idea if you bring a parachute. <laughs> so I, well, no, in fact, seaplanes are the number one killer of Canadians after black bears. That is fascinating. That is fascinating, but I'm not getting in one. I made that up. Sorry. <laughs> I love it. That really is like pop-up tech talk. <laughs> I'm just here to have fun. <laughs> Thank you so much, Christopher, for being on the show. Thank you very much. We'll see you next time on Pop-Up Tech Talks.